All right. Uh, well, since the other two appear to be like daytime posters, maybe we have to be in daytime to see them. Akredo says, uh, I was floating around, saw this channel and recommended and wanted to come to see another fighting game for it. Well, thank you. Thank you for, for hanging out. We, we play a lot of fighting games here. Soul Sloth is asking if I am getting tired. No, I'm not really tired. I kind of just woke up, actually. <laughs> not literally. I woke up at like 8, but uh, I'm a little bit... Uh, Lethargic. My day hasn't really started yet, and uh, I need—I just need to record a bit before my actual day starts. Uh, look at this. So we switched it to daytime, and we're being guided on the map now. So maybe some of these posters are only up during the day, inexplicably, which doesn't really make sense, but we'll take it. Five one. All right. And now we'll just go do the other one. This is gonna guide us right there. I'm gonna be so mad if it's in a location we already checked and it just wasn't there at night. Oh. God, these guys are annoying. There we go. We did it. It literally is. It's in the location that I checked that had like the level 40 enemies. Unbelievable. <laughs> I knew I had found it and still it just didn't let us see. <laughs> That's annoying. SG-33, Super Turbo 33. All right. Uh, what, what was the code? Uh, items, key items. Wait, how is this passcode poster one? How do we know that this is two and this is three? This is the first one we picked up and the first one in the message. <laughs> 332951. Our credit says first, second, third. That's lame. <laughs> it's clever, but it's lame. I hate it. All right, asterisk. Who is this? Bosch? No. Something's off here. I told Bosch to get in touch with me at this number. Who is this? A friend of Bosch? Jeez. Stop. Just send one text message, please. And you're wondering where he is? Well, hmm. How does he know if I'm wondering where he is? I haven't sent any texts. This is a one-sided conversation. As an information broker, I'll tell you uh, whatever it is you want to know for a price. But considering the client relationship here, cash doesn't seem like an appropriate form of payment. How about you collect some intel from me instead? I want to know more about a specific fighter. Uh, seems like he was taking it to a construction site at Metro City. Find him for me. Do that, and I'll show everything I know for you. I've, I've already found him. I'm using his power. Wear a safety helmet and sneak into the construction site. I've already done this. What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, oops. I don't want the world map. I want the regular map. I have already done this game. <laughs> Why are you making me do this again? Oh, I needed to talk to him anyway, so may as well. Tracked him down, huh? That's him, all right. Ken Masters. And the location is a construction site at the CERN building. Mm -hmm. Uh, Never expected a fame fighter like him to be slinking around a place like this. Oh, oops.
Uh, that's some juicy stuff right here. Thanks. I'll keep my end of the bargain, of course, and message you about Bosch shortly. Real quick, though, think you might be interested in doing some more intel gathering? Plenty of clients out there looking for intel on fighters. For starters, I star I'm starved for an up-to-date info on fighters from Japan. I hear there's a sumo-themed restaurant in Metro City's west side. As good a place to start as any, I imagine. I'm not asking you to do this for free, of course. I'll do more digging into Bosch's situation for one. You scratch my back, I scratch yours. Now go ahead and get scratching. Okay, so this part's kind of goofy, though, because he's like... He sent us a picture of Ken in this construction site and was like, I need you to dig up some info. And then we go to the construction site. They have proof that Ken is at. And they're like, never expected a fame fighter to be slinking around a place like this. That's juicy stuff. Thanks. And it's like, bro, bro, you sent me a picture of him here. Why did you need me to come here? What are you talking about? What is going on? <laughs> Hate to ask this, but I have a request I'd like to make. Rather, I'd like to ask a question in my place. Here's the question. What's on the gentleman's docket today? I wonder how they'll respond. Okay, I wasn't expecting that to be a side quest, but we'll take it. This is so goofy. Alright, I think, though, that this is going to give us Honda's. If we do the main quest here, it will give us Honda's abilities in his fight uh, fighting style. So, I do want to do that as soon as I can. So, we're going to head here. All right, let's keep going. Just gotta run for a million feet, do this tutorial mission. Land counter hits when your opponent starts an attack, but you hit them out of it, that's a counter hit. Even better, counter hits deal bonus damage. So with that in mind, let's get practicing. How about it? So for Kettle, uh, who asked earlier if this game is good, uh, like if World Tour is a good introduction into like how to play the actual game, like this is a good example of like how the game tutorializes it. Is it's like here's the mechanics, here's how you do it. You do these little side quests that teach you things. Change location, time of day, take different lessons. Try looking for Alice and Ryan. Great hustle out there today. Cool, bud. Thanks. I'm not platform for nothing. <laughs> I know how to get a counter hit. <laughs> Here's that's what's up with Bosch. He was thirsty for info in an underground fighting tournament. One that just so happens to be run by a massive criminal org. Mad Gear something something. Uh, Mad Gear handed over some major cash to try and weasel their way in until Bosch stole it. What did he intend to use the money for? You'll have to gather more info from me before I have the answer. Specifically in intel on a truly legendary Japanese fighter. Get me information on someone like that and I'd, it'd really make my day. Moving right along, your assignment. Successfully perform drive parries. Drive parries will protect you from all of your opponent's attacks, all of them, with the notable exception of throws. Remember that, those throws will get you. Your drive gauge will continuously drain while your parry is active, but successful parries will recover it slightly. Time it right so you don't waste it. Well, ready to give it a shot? Sure am. Come on, keep coking me. Pretty simple. Well, that's all the lessons I have for this time of day. You've already improved. Can you tell? Sure can. Change your location, time of day, blah, blah, blah. Same thing they always say. Getting so many miles. Oh, Retsu again. I was watching the tournament. You really put on a show back there. How's it feel having others watching you fight? It makes me want to become strong. Ah, ah, ah. If that's what it took to get your butt in gear, I'm all for it. You're still in the middle of your journey, though. Yes. Okay, okay, I read you. Got no time to stand around chewing the fat, huh? Put up your dukes, then, because I'm coming for you. Street Fighter 1, baddie. Oh, boy. Sex kick. Trade. Oh boy. Alright, 
he's always going to tech my throws. Oh, fuck. Ah, I don't have the timing. It's punishable on block. It also is probably weak to DI. Yep. I don't remember Ken's specials or supers, I mean. Jeez, he does so much damage. There we go. And if I just DI him every single time he does that, it should be fine. Oh, fuck. Okay, it's quarter circle back kit. That's what it is. Wow, Dragon Lash does no damage. What? He threw me? I was mashing through. There we go. Get zoned. I don't know why Super didn't come out there. That was weird. Nice. Take that, Ratsu. Not too shabby. You're coming into your own. Looks to me like you're starting to figure out which path it is you're walking. Oh. Huh? Listen to me. I'm starting to sound like him. Ah, well. Hey, hand me your phone for a sec, will ya? I'm sensing destiny here, so I figure I might as well give you my contact info. <laughs> Red Sea's like, you're such a good fighter, I'm sliding into your DMs. And done. Go ahead and contact me when the mood strikes. Next time we meet, I expect you to be even tougher. Until then. <laughs> That's he's fun. He's he's a funny little guy. Oh, new skills available from Ken. Great. Goy show. Odd lighting artifact on E Honda's chin there for a second. Hello, sir. Daddy. Edomond, because his name is Edomondo, Edmund Honda. Get out, shy. A sumo wrestler, yeah, that's probably the guy. Photo would be icing on the cake, though. 
Some missions involve using your camera at specific locations. These photo spots are marked with an icon. Accessing. All right. Uh, this is gonna suck to take a to to do this on hitbox with. Oh man, I can already barely position the the camera as is. How do I how do I do this? Uh. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Uh. How do I do this? count okay uh, how do I take the picture I don't have print screen on my keyboard because I, I use a pen keyless I don't understand what does it want me to do Huh. They really weren't thinking about people who play the game with an arcade stick, were they? Uh. Huh? How do I do this? Hold on, I have to actually look this up. Street Fighter World Tour 8 4. Big in Japan, that's what I need. All right, um, or, oh, it's mission mode, not photo mode. Okay, there you go. Get them cheeks in view. This guy, yeah, I've heard of him. No denying he's from Japan, that's for sure. I'll take it, intel is intel. I'll send you additional info about Bosch after this. What's up? All right. You're looking for a legendary Japanese fighter? Then make no mistake, you're looking right at him. <laughs> then again, you might be looking for Mr. Fireball and Dragon Punch. See ya. Drop by Gembu Temple in Japan. You might just find him there. Okay. I can tell by looking at you that you're not here for the Chanko. No, you're the kind of person who's always looking for an opportunity to get buff. You're darn right I am. The fire in a person's eyes never lies. Let me treat you to a little sumo training then. Good, this is who I want to, to play as, so it's fine. Look at them cheeks. I'm caked up. He's wearing his, uh, his OG costume. Good advice. Good stuff. 
You could tell by looking at you that you'd have a knack for it. I was about to teach you one of my patented sumo techniques. There's never any harm in learning a thing or two. Nice. All right, so we have Honda's uh, style. 100 hand, sumo, headbutt. Uh, neat. Okay. Um, let's see. Status. Honda style. I don't want rising up cut. I want sure you can. I'll take one edge Duray because Honda also has a command throw. It's a different input, but we'll take it. And now that I have headbutt, it's fine. I don't need rolling attack. Even though rolling attack is probably a little bit better than headbutt, honestly, all things considered. Just because rolling attack is completely unpunishable and uh, headbutt isn't. There's Carlos again. You came. You're ready then. No need for words. Let us begin. Oh fuck, I forgot about this. <laughs> oh my god, he did my whole health bar. Oh, that's a low. If I get hit even once by the, by the, uh, oh shit. Oh no. He's gonna wreck me. Oh fuck. I'm dead. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, if I'm holding back after I exit the menu, it doesn't actually count as holding back. That's interesting. I have to let go of back and then uh I can't what I'm saying is I can't maintain charge while pausing the game. Okay, so that breaks breaks armor completely. See? So I can't hold back there. It. I'm not gonna be able to beat him anytime soon. I'll need to uh, I'll need to get stronger. He has more than double my health and uh, takes a ton of damage, so that's fine. All right, uh, I can level up though. I think, right? What's the thing that I use to do that? I don't remember. Skills. Here we go. Greatly increases defense. That's what we want. Well, we got a little bit more of that stuff. Special move, special move, special move, special move to learn from all these people, it seems like. So that's on the list, is to talk to all of our previous masters in a minute. Just to get some more deranged uh, stuff to add to our kit. Hey, got a moment? We've got a code red on our hands. A real dangerous type situation, you could say. Some no-good Nick gang members have decided one of the subway platforms is now their turf. As you might imagine, that's keeping ordinary law-abiding subway enthusiasts from riding. Sounds bad, right? Exactly. So, uh, think you might be able to do something about those subway besmirchers for me? The platform they took over is one by Hagger Stadium. Just hop on the subway and head on over there. I don't want to hop on the subway. I want to just fast travel there. Fine. Fine, I guess. Fight! 
Oh, ah, there you go. <sighs> Got the subway train handled. Oh, I was accidentally changing the uh, thing. To get some level ups, I guess. New skills available from Honda. So, oh, so we'll get the we'll get the super. It's full. That's fine. He's a cure's a little bit groovy. That's it? Are we? Did we just finish it? And there's nothing else to do in here? This is Urban Park. Urban Park Station. There we go. Where are the gang members I need to beat? Oh, is it right here? Hey. Oh, hey, you're back. Bet you were surprised, huh? Sorry about that. The whole gang takeover thing was a little white lie. I work in the subway PR department. Figured some action shots of you stomping punks would make for great ads. Trying to find actual gang members to help out was going nowhere fast, so I roped in a guy from the Novice League. Thanks to you guys, I was able to get some incredible photos. You're fine with me using them, right? I appreciate it. Oh, and before you ask, the guys you fought in the train were actual gang members. Needless to say, I wasn't exactly dying to follow you in there. They're always threatening other passengers and getting into trouble. If you ever feel like hopping on the train just to teach those punks a lesson, be my guest. Oh, that's right. Oh, oops. Uh, and just between you and me, it sounds like they're hiding some kind of treasure on there, so, you know, incentive. They'll run into different people just about each time you ride, so stop by often to keep them all in check, would you? Alrighty. So there's just, like, junk on the train that we can, we can get, I guess. That's not too bad. Alright. Uh, I do need to go to the world map. We'll do that really quick. Now we can go to Japan. Genbu, a temple that lies deep in the mountains surrounded by abundant na natural beauty. Fighters often visit in search of a place to meditate. Let's go! Woohoo. You. All righty. What can I get for you? you? Want bargains? I've got bargains. All right, we're gonna beat him up first, though. I have to beat him with Edmund Honda style, which I have equipped. Oh boy, he's just punching. Tight. 
Did that count as 10 punches? That's funny. Come. Sorry, buddy. I'm just, I'm not in the mood for that right now. There we go. Trip paid for itself. Let's go. Get up. Get your ass up. I gotta buy some stuff from you, dude. What can I get for you? All right, Nito. Please come again. Always happy to have your business, friend. All right, it's time to take a picture of Ryu. Ah, oh, this is Ryu, the Japanese martial artist. Martial artist meditating by a temple, huh? That's some quality intel. In return, I've got another nugget of info about Bosch for you. Ever heard of a place called Neshal? It's a tiny little developing Asian nation tucked away somewhere in Asia. Whole place is buzzing with activity, development projects out the wazoo. And some citizens aren't fans of the way the government's doing things. In fact, Bosch is part of an anti-government resistance group. He was probably planning to use the cash he stole from Mad Gear to help his buddies come back home. Which brings me to the next piece of intel. But before I get to that, I got a little favor to ask. I need you to meet this uh, meet with a security guard at the CERN building in Metro City. All right, let me do that. What are my rewards? Is it just kudos? Telling me, yeah, it's just kudos. It's fine. Oh, and this is just telling me the cash shop has stuff. Okay. Ooh. All right, so we go back to Metro now. What is that? Jury JP at night. And I don't know who's the top one during the day. Couldn't say. And Lily's at the Thunderfoot settlement. Let's go there. I don't think I've gone here yet. I think I forgot. Mexico! <laughs> nice cool cutscene man she's showing cheek holy crap Respected of all shamans, Elder Tlin. Did you have something to say? Really, this person is a lie. Hmm? Say what? We are gonna team get. Read them one. Evil best. <laughs> Just who are you really? Oh, you know what? It might be Rashid in the shawl. You don't need to respect Lily. You can just, you can just toss her. She's not hard. Well 
If she can't get wind stocks, she's useless. This is what happens when you don't have an invincible reversal. Hold back to block Lily, Jesus. Guess you're not an evil pest after all. Sorry about that. Singing Wolf is never wrong, but sometimes even I can't figure out what he's saying. When you live it to that age, you tend to end up with one foot firmly in the spirit world, so... I think maybe instead of evil pest, he was probably saying esteemed guest. Talk about a misunderstanding. Hmm, need anything? I want to be your student. My student? Sure, I don't mind. I'd better consult the spirits first, though. I call upon you, great wind. Toino Ikonoi, spirit of the wind. Don't fight it. Let yourself become one with it. Yes, just like that. Looks like the spirits are smiling upon you too. <laughs> nice <-er. clears throat> When you're just starting out, all you need to do is mimic the moves of others. That's how I got my start. There was a great warrior of my tribe and I imitated his moves to learn them by myself. Now all you have to do is imitate my moves and learn my fighting style. She's talking about T-Hawk, but at the same time, why would you ever, why would you ever give, because you need, to use any of Lily's moves, you need to have, be, be wind clad. So you, you need to have Condor wind. So you lose two move slots for any of Lily's moves because her base moves suck. Uh, let's see. World map. So yeah, is that Rashid in the daytime slot possibly? Night at Metro City is Jamie and someone else. I'm not sure though. I'm not sure who that could be. USA. Oh shit, I need to do nighttime. Oh, Kratos says, yeah, I wanted to like Lily more, but I gravitated towards Manon. Yeah, we have quite a few Manon players in chat. Manon is is, is pretty popular. We, li we like her. I take it you're the one in the informant mentioned? Hey, no need to answer. I'm tasked with handling this bad boy right here. That's all. Here, key card to the CERN building. Now it's all yours. Don't lose it. Did you get it? I want you to use that to sneak into the CERN building. You don't need to collect any classified company secrets or anything, but there are a few things I'd like you to... Borrow, specifically a researcher's lab coat and a CERN staffer's name card. I'll tell you what they're for after you acquire them. Wait until nightfall, then sneak inside the construction site. Pro tip, don't get caught. Clear. Watch it be Bosch. Watch it be Bosch, who is the person we're talking to. <laughs> All right, so we have to infiltrate this place at night, huh? That's pretty exciting. <laughs> 